Gas prices impact almost every aspect of life, but for some, the high cost could force a career path change. 27 News reporter Matthew Johnson joins us live from Shawnee County. For more, Matthew. For some, their work vehicle and personal car are one and the same. With high gas prices, those who deliver are facing a difficult dilemma that's putting their livelihood at risk. This is Jared Cobb. He lives in Overbrook, Kansas, but travels to Topeka to DoorDash six to seven days a week. When he was full time, he'd work 18 hour shifts dashing. Now with the high cost of gas, that isn't an option for many delivery drivers. App based delivery services like DoorDash have a base pay per order. While helpful, that base, pay, that base pay alone doesn't turn a profit or in some instance account for the cost of travel. When people don't tip, drivers can end up losing money instead of making money for the service they provide. We're here to make a profit just like any other people when they go to 8 to 5 Monday through Friday job. You know, they go there to make money, to pay their bills, to support their family, buy a house, car, whatever they want to do. It's like same thing with DoorDash, I go there to support my family. Additionally, drivers aren't compensated for driving back to the busy restaurant part of town, making the trip back to Wanamaker from southeast Topeka without a tip even more brutal. If drivers don't see your delivery distance as cost effective, it'll take longer for someone to accept the request, which means you'll be waiting on your Taco Bell for a longer than usual. Live in Shawnee County, working for you, Matthew Johnstone, 27 News.